Joy! Is a guy who's not me. Before Kirby in the Amazing Mirror in the last episode, I finished up Area 1. So obviously, we're gonna go on to Area 5! Because, you know, I kind of promised that, didn't I? Uh, first, in order to get to Area 5, we have to kill that mirror guy again. So, let's use my handy dandy parasol. Twirling. <laughs> oh, look, twirling that thing. And let's be safe with an air pump. There we go. Okay, here we are in Terra Castle. Uh, like I said, this wind part, don't um, fall in love with it because we won't be seeing it for very long. Uh, here we got multi paths uh, that lead to different stuff. Um, really, whatever door you choose. Well, actually, it does matter, but uh, we're gonna go into the top one first. Um, gotta fight these guys first. But, uh, yeah, again, uh, don't fall in love with the wind parts because we will not, you know, be very efficient for that one. Oh yeah, it doesn't matter what room you go into, it will ultimately lead the same way as this uh, the bottom one and the upper one um, have different actions. It's like, ah! Okay, you die. Take that. If I can't beat him, eat him! Ha <laughs> ha! I cut you into tricks. Ah, uh, I hate that eat. Okay, so moving on. Um, Alright, down there there's a door, but we don't want to go in that door just yet. Whoa! Everything just gets blue. Anyways, here is actually an access point to uh, another area. Uh, area 7, just to spoil that little bit. But we're not going to Area 7 just yet, we're going to Area 5. We still got Area 6 to do, too. Alright, so, um... This is where that one other door goes. Uh, I think, ultimately, I don't know. Anyways, button! Yes, this is actually the, um... The second button to Carrot Castle, and we're barely... We just... We're pretty much right at the entrance point of it, too. Alright, that's the wrong button again. Uh, really getting used to the controls. Uh, before we go in there real quick... Hit that, and we get another one of these, um... Quick access point things. However, this one, again, should be useless. Yeah, Area 8, Radish Ruins, but we can't go there. Because just like that one door that went to all of Ocean... Yeah, the we pretty much, um... I think we're spoiled pretty much all the areas now. I think Area 7 is pretty much the only one that I haven't shown the name in some way yet. But anyways, now we're in Carrot Castle, the rest of this uh, place will be Castle Um, yeah, I don't know. Just, you know, go with it. Uh, enemy-wise, um, you'll see a, quite a few beam abilities, um, a lot of normals too. Like, walk in the walk that I hate. And, uh, of course, everything else annoying. Okay, so, let's go down here first. Yeah, you die. Alright, another mirror, so be careful. I hate these guys. Alright, so in here we got a cannon room. A bunch of spikes, so obviously your goal is to not do what I just did and shoot yourself into spikes. Uh, ah, damn it. Okay, there are two, uh, real major paths that you can do in this, uh, room. Um, uh, this cannon basically leads to both of them, though, so if you shoot to the rightward one, you'll get this one-up. And this, uh, har 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 tomato. Alright, and now we're here at the door. Now this leads forward, um, yeah, <laughs> fun little fact. Kirby is actually small enough that he can squeeze through the Gordos, um, as they pass over. However, um, at this point, if you do that, you're just gonna fall down into the spikes. Uh, that bomb block, in order to get this potion here, you gotta suck it up. No. Alright, so now we got another multi-path cannon room. Um, um, and most of them loop back to, to this cannon here. However, there is one room that, um, you, you absolutely should go through. You know. Oh, maybe I can't pass through those. Alright, so maybe you can just dodge it in this corner in that one room. Anyways, in this room, you need to, um, use the mini to get to here. And in this chest is... A Vitality! I don't think I've gotten one of these yet. Uh, Vitality, understandably enough, adds one extra point to Kirby's health. So, um, there aren't very many of these in the game. Uh, the number offhand is a loot to me, but, um... Yeah, uh, ch uh, try and find these whenever you can. Because they will be helpful. Especially in this one, because the boss of Area 5 is pretty bad. Alright, so we got another fight with the fan fan, so let's go kill him. 
the, yeah, uh, the, the basic way of killing this guy is that every now and then he'll roll out apples, and basically, whoa, Yellow Kirby owned him with that smash ability, apparently. Alright, so we got the throw ability again, probably won't be holding on to this for very long. Yep, yep, there we go. Ah, that. Okay, I got it. Okay. I hate blocks. Don't you. Okay, so in this room, more Gordos. Which one of these is the way forward? Oh man, I could have uh, I could have got that star block to throw one of those gray blocks. Okay, now we're on the way forward, okay. Now I don't believe there's any treasure in this room. This is just a random cannon room. However, you can fly past certain like items like that. One up right there in the cherry. And both of them lead to here. The silent treatment obviously means it's time for another boss. Now this boss, you want to get a ranged move, so get Cutter or Bong. Cutter is probably more stable. Alright, so here's the boss already. We're already fighting the boss of Area 5. Mega Titan. Uh, this guy is... Uh, I want to say this guy is the hardest boss in the game. Um, unless you people have more difficulty than the final boss. But uh, yeah, this boss is a real pain. Because first off, you can't hurt it through conventional moves. And, um, second, it's got four arms that continuously fires at you, so you gotta constantly be aware of that, and I'm not. And then the walls of this place are electrified, which is the only way you can hurt Mega Titan, but if any of your abilities um, touch that electric spot, you're screwed. Alright, so, um, it's actually better to just use the regular stars than the, um, arms emit, because it actually propels Mega Titan a lot further than, um, of what a regular ability would. Oh, God. All right, and let's get him. Ah! Ah, oh, man, that was not fair. Die. All right, now he's dead. But why am I calling? Oh, can't let you win that, Kirby. So yeah, the last, uh, the Megatitan also has a second form, which is this annoying little head that flies around and shoots missiles at you. The cool thing about this, though, is that you can actually just redirect the missiles at him, so... Yeah. And it only takes two hits. You can see his health is already down. And... Yeah! One vitality left, and I kill him. Ha 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 ha! I win! And there's Mirror Charge 4. Ooh, I hate that boss. I really hate that boss. And why I lost heal of Kirby, no! Okay, back in this room. Remember this room? Yes, this is the very beginning of the castle. Uh, we went down the lower path, so now we're gonna go up this upper path here. First off, this room here has a Cupid, for some reason. And a 1-Up. Yay! We have to always use 1-Ups. Alright, so... Traveling down here, be careful with this door because it's a sneak attack! By giant wall of ease. Um, alright, go to the right, uh, be careful this blocking guy here. Run away! And, uh... Haha! -ha! My uh, treasure animation killed you in your face. Uh, but we got a cherry, though. So. Haha, <laughs> you died for a cherry. So now we're at the top of uh, Carrot Castle. The thing about Carrot Castle is that it's actually pretty quick of an area because um, you can uh, you can explore through most of the dungeon on like one run through. Um, yeah, and all the paths lead to the same way. Like with Cabbage Cavern, there's a bit of exploration. Ha! You thought I killed myself? No, I didn't. I just got a music note thing. And yeah, that's showing, like, that's actually connected to that room there. Yeah, most people will probably miss that room because, like, they don't think, like, oh man, I can't fall down there or I'm gonna die. But no, the game just wanted to be a little wily there. Crap, what was I talking about? Uh, yeah, my memory. I wish I remembered. Oh my god. I, I, I can't believe this. My memory is just so bad, I swear. I had like the memory of a 90 year old woman on Alzheimer's. <sighs> okay, so I can't break through that. Okay, here we got stuff. So, uh, let's see here. Got that, and I think I did that wrong. Ah, oop. Yeah, I did that wrong. Crap. Okay, this is the way you're supposed to do this. You call your friends, and they hit the bomb block, 
And then you hit this bomb block. There we go. And your prize is a yellow Kirby uh, palette. And I'm about out of time, at least for now. Yeah, D-Bag. This is Guy Question 9. There's Shadow Kirby in the pen. And I'm invincible now, so. Yeah. End of video time.